Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to an episode of Echoes of the Plum Road. Last episode, baby Selena was born. Very cute. Um, I have no idea what else I did. It's been a few days since I filmed and I've been playing a lot in my other scenes. So I, I really have no idea. You want hot, sure. Uh, you are just giving me a gift of a fiddlehead. Thank you. And you are giving me bread. Thank you. Um, in between episodes, I worked on something. I decided I was getting confused as to who is married to who. So I made a family tree. Uh, here it is. So this is uh, essentially a town family tree, I think I have everyone, of all the marriages that have happened through summer nine, I believe that's the day we are on. So up here is us. So this is technically our family. So we are married to William. Here's our two kids. These I'm going to evolve this over time also. This is his brother who is married to Kat. These are two of Kat's children. She is the sister of Walter Hall, and this is their child that they have. Um, and this is the McBells. They, she is uh, passed away. I still need to make an icon for that. I will. I'm working on it. Uh, she has passed away. This is their child. And then this is another marriage that has now taken place, which is Roland. Here's his mother or their mother. Uh, they married Martha Lloyd, and these are Martha's two children, Penelope and Bridget. Going over to here, this family really hasn't changed. Um, these two are sisters, Mabel and Sarah. Sarah is married to the doctor, Jessup. These are their two ki kids, Verity and Ruth. Then we have Mabel and Edwin, uh, and their children are Emery and Molly. The next family is the Odells. Both of these kids are new. They, th this is the newest one, I believe. Uh, she was pregnant when we started the game, so that's Tom and Alice Odell. And now we have Raymond and Alvin Odell. Then the Johns family, I believe he has passed away. And they were are married. These are their children, Judith and Lewis. And then Lewis has now married Rose the Fisher. And then uh, this family, I don't remember from this day if he died. I, I've been playing my other save a lot, so I don't know. So Quentin is married to Mary, and these are their two kids, Benjamin and Isabel. She has no family, which is really sad. She's just sitting out here on her lonesome. Then we have the Huttons, James with his daughter Madeline, and then Jacob with his son Clark. So that is, oh, then the Baileys. Can't forget the Baileys. And then this is Matthew with his wife, Agnes, and then their two kids, Martin and Edward. So that is the current family tree. So yes, that's the family tree for this save. Um, I, like I said, I think I'm going to try to keep that updated in game. Um, like once a month in game, like the, or I guess season, these are seasons. Um, just try to keep it up to date. I did add already um, who has passed away. I, I did that sh like a, a different day. I added little tombstones to everyone who's passed away. And then I've also updated the portraits for the people who have grown from being kids um, into adults. I have also updated that too. It's just it's more of a pain in the butt because... You have to log into the game and you have to um, actually hit a right button. <laughs> you have to come into here and do this and do a snapshot, 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 every single one. It's not really need to edit it, so it's not fun to do. So for like the other ones, um, like when it was just, I could just go on the wiki and just Take the picture from there. That was nice and easy. Oh, I love those ones so much more. But like all the kids that are born are random names. Like they're random names. And then when they grow up, like the ones who are born after the game starts, I guess I should put that additional information onto that. Those kids will always look different when they grow up. And 
like the kids who are born after the start of the game will always have different names and that type of stuff. So it's like you can't just, you know, take the picture from the wiki for those. Those you gotta, I gotta make up myself. So that's why some of them aren't as nice as others because some I'm taking from the game, the other ones are nice clear pictures. It, it reached a point where it took me about five hours to do that. So it will, this will be the only time it takes me that long because um, now it's kind of set, you know, so. But anyway, so today I need to look at our quests. Um, I would like, like, I think we'll, we'll I'm going to start that sentence again. I am or was working towards a coup. But I also started thinking that it would probably be a good shout to do the, what goes in there, this I need for a quest. Um, I kind of thought it would be a good shout to do, um, this soon. And even this would be fine soon. So we're, I think, going to work on this today. This just gives you charcoal. This is definite. This one is definitely more use, but we'll, we'll eventually build them both. So how much stone do I have? Well, there's our last of those. Here's our stone. Those are my nails. Ah, uh, sand can go away. Um, By the end of this season. Okay, so I just need charcoal. So well, we can go to... Roland for that. Um, <coughs> I, have have I actually went outside for once. Hor horrific, horrific, I know. Just horrible. Um, <laughs> and yeah, it was really bad. I had to go plant flowers. I had to go touch some grass for a little while. Um, it was awful. I did think about why my daughter, was it my daughter in this? Why the um, blacksmith was not open for um so oh sorry really makes me think about far off places that I've never been seen my and might never see true um I was thinking about until next time my actually what do I need, I need to look at the quest that's the first off I'm not gonna be able to do that this I probably am also not gonna be able to do unless pe someone says peaches this I can do this I'm probably unfortunately not going to be able to do unless someone gets fruit salad in the, the inn. I would like to do this. The two recipes. We will have to go fishing today and then we need 15 charcoal together. And then goat meat, more hops. What do you have for... Nothing helpful. Thanks for nothing. Um, No, I, I, was go I was thinking about like why... A lot of the um, uh, apprenticeships were not open for uh, my son, for Wesley. And so, like, I went back into my really old save that I actually still had a copy of. And I figured it out. The reason that I had, he was able to become an apprentice. So, okay, you can only, uh, you can only get an apprenticeship if there's an opening. Um, and the reason I was able to get an apprenticeship for my son and my other save at the blacksmith was because uh, the... Um, you don't have anything useful. Okay. Um, is because... Uh, what's his name? Um, the guy with the mean, muggy, sad face. His apprentice. Not you. You. He died. He died almost like a week after becoming an adult. Uh, I was trying to figure out what was different. Why we're but we in general are are really not lucky in this save though for that type of stuff. I think for Selena when she's a little bit older, I might get her an apprenticeship with um the doctor because in my other save I'm I'm still working on um who am I looking for? I went and got my kid an apprenticeship with the doctor and he gives me medicine Ooh, thank you um almost every other day it's wonderful who else am i looking for jessup 
Yeah, so as being the apprentice for the doctor, I think I've gotten like three bottles of medicine from him already. Again, luck of the draw. Um, hello, nice seeing you. You around, oh, I've been seeing you around lately. I'm happy to have a, found a friend in Honeywood. I thought it would never happen. Yeah, yeah, because he always, you get access to this inventory every day and all the medicines, and then he gives you medicine, um, which is really kind of nice. What else can be turned in? I don't think anything. We need to go to the butcher. Closed Thursday. Well, it ain't Thursday. <sighs> I don't know if I need that, but I will take it just in case. Okay. So, four items uh i need two goats and four chicken legs uh it's a little strange that there's a witch living on our island but i try not to judge oh rose is just ro so romantic rose is just so romantic sometimes oh that's his wife i'm like okay great i won fine be that way. That's fine. I don't mind paying 70. Okay. And who was that for? Ah, we'll go here. Oh, and we can pick the lavender again today. At yeah, the other save, I have to say, part of me really wishes that was uh, the channel save. I was just thinking about something. If you can get your hands on wild strawberries, they make for a nice summer snack. Uh, I've heard that Agnes Bailey enjoys knitting in her free time. Uh, no, I wish that, sometimes I really wish that that save was the save because, um, Oh man, I am in autumn and I have two kids already. Um, that's really, that just sucks. I mean, they're just stone path. I'm just, that makes me mad. Okay, so we can't do this. I need to go to Roland and then we need to go fishing. Okay, um, yeah, for that save, I, it's the officially the clothing save. Um, that is what I call it, the clothing save, because I have so much clothing, so much so that I sell said clothing. And um, without really doing much, I have like $4,000 in the bank. Yeah. Who's this kid? Well, that's our kid. Ah! Uh, okay, I forgot what my kid looks like. Yeah, you just... Look at my a kid in my other save has brown hair, so I, that's the kid I'm used to seeing right now. Tools of durability, so they'll break over time. It's just something to be aware of. Must be stressful to be a mermaid. They're supposed to sing, right? So we have five. Okay. Uh, have that, have that. I don't know if I still need to donate this, so I have those. And I'm also trading with these in the safe. Oh uh, yeah, but it's like the clothing save and I have a whole new outfit. They are giving me clothing that is worth like 200 coins each time. Like, um... Who is it? Uh, she and her and her and her maybe 
Every single time they see me, pretty much give me a new clothing item. Oh, I wanted to go in here. I have a whole new dress. I have a fancy dress now. It's somewhat fancy. It's better than it's better than this. Um, with a hat that matches and shoes that match. It's like a purpley outfit. <laughs> like a purplish with like a a lot of a little bit of brown in it. Uh yeah, it's just I have so much money. I think I just I had to keep selling the clothing because I have nowhere to store them. There's nowhere for me to store it anymore. Like I I had to keep building more chests for storing clothing. So I'm like, I don't want to sell it. I don't want to sell it. And it's like, oh, I have to sell it. He is all was also sick in my save for over a week, and then he finally died. And so I, I built my coop and I couldn't do anything with it because only he has the animals. And now I have to try to find what kid of his took over. And Circa the most fascinating th little creatures. Creatures? Creatures. Nice new word. I could study them all day. Some cheeses are rich and creamy while others are light and airy. Ah, uh, a latte, eh? I'll try that. Um, but yeah, it's just, I have so much money. Like, I'm literally just throwing money at people at this point. Like, there's nothing I can't build or buy. It's just so crazy. It is just so crazy, the differences. Uh, that is why I still stand by that there is a seed uh, in the background that we just don't, we're not aware of. There has to be a seed information. Uh, just because it's so crazy, the difference. What would you like, good sir? Good day. I hope you've been well. The older I get, the more I feel I'm in touch with the world around me. When you get to be my age, it's important to enjoy the little things in life. True. You want that. That's a lot. Okay, we'll try. Okay, we going home. Oh, we're going home. There's nothing else I can get right now. So we're going to go home. But yeah, like I, I'm like I said, I'm in, um, I'm going to go through the forest really quick though. Um, I also doing, uh, like I said, it's fall. And so like in fall, there's a lot more disease happening. And right now there's like a disease going through and it's like the, it's the Ryle family and the Bailey family. And like uh, William still works as a, a carpenter in that save on like the hunter in this save, which I'm wondering if it's because I did this look for a job. I don't know. Part of me is wondering if that's why. I did the same thing in the other one and he was fine. He went back to being a carpenter. I don't know. I have a kid who's an apprentice at the carpenter and then he works at the carpenter and his brother does. I don't know what's going on with this one. But um, yeah, so there's a there's like a, a little mini epidemic type going through or influenza, influenza or epidemic going through town. And yeah, I think we're gonna be, I'm gonna be losing the entire Ryle family. And I think the Baileys are now, it's going to the Baileys. It's like, okay, all right. And like, see my kids going by there. I'm like, oh, stay away, please stay away. Please don't go near them. <laughs> Cause I'm immunized, but I can't immunize my children. I wish I could though. Hi, hi dear. I love working outside. I don't think I could be a baker. Sure, money doesn't grow on trees, but a smile is always free. I don't know. I did find out these are all of these do appear on um here under uh no 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 it's family the C and then this. There are bugs on one of these. I don't remember which one there, but I saw bugs the other day because I my kid had a bug on him. I'm like, OK, it's it was like 10 cents. It's not all bugs. It's ones that it's ones that like can be used in, I think, crafting. But I noticed it the other day. Um, but I don't remember enough to. To remember exactly where... Oh, I'm starving. Why am I not eating food? Uh, 
French fries. Have French fries because I'm sick of them taking up a spot. Hmm. Okay. So we're going home, seeing what we have, what we can make, what we can do, all that good stuff. You put like the uh, the sick villagers. Um, you can actually see them normally on this menu, like before Matthew Bailey passed away. Um, underneath his eyes, he had like these. It looked like you like you do when you're really tired. That's how he looked for days leading up to his death. So it's like I knew he was dying, and I also needed to find him for like to get chickens and stuff. I just built a coop and I'd done all these things. So it's like I needed to find him, but at the same time, like I am saying so far away from you, like you have the plague. Um, so I have my brickies, I have this. So we can make this. Yay, we are moving forward. But something, another thing we're going to start making I think I started saying this and got distracted. Before um, fall, I want to make this. That's the next thing I think I want to make. Okay, we need more nails. Did I buy Roland out of nails? I don't know. I'll go back to town and see if they have nails. Yes. I don't know why for some reason I didn't think I clicked on the sign, but I didn't. I didn't think I clicked on the sign. <sighs> um, just because oh, I don't know if I actually need that machine, but like the way the holiday is worded for that time of year, it says something about kids will come to your house. It's almost like it's like trick or treating or something. Oh, you're good enough. I didn't. I didn't even read. I apologize. Oh, you've got nails up the wazoo. Uh, sell, sell, sell. Have some grapes. Uh, and those. I will give you some of these. That's fine. Okay. Um. There we go. Another thing I learned is. Uh, when you get to the ghosty quests, like, do I have any? No, we actually need to go there. Oh, I have one. Uh, for the ghosties, for some of their quests, because I, like, I had a bunch of them and I started ignoring them. And then I'm like, no, I need to see what they want. And so I clicked on them and some of the, if some of your town folk have passed away, Sometimes they do the same thing they do over here where you, they have a quest bubble like above their head. And even the ghost will give you gifts like um, Temperance Cromp or whatever her name is. Uh, Roland's mother. She gave me $50 on a recipe one day. Like I, she, she passed away and it saved me. I'm like, oh, I, I'll deal with you fine. Because she's normally wants you to insult people. That's what she wants. And so I'm like, fine, what do you want? And so she's like, here, take $50. And she was all happy about it too. I'm like, wow, why could you not have been this lovely in life? I'm like, really? You were you were actually lovely right now. Um, what else can go in here? <sighs> I will move this up and I will move that up. And I will move this up. Okay. Uh, we need to check for, I don't think anyone worked on this today. No. Um, you go in there, you go in there. I'm looking for this. I know I had some. There's my grapes. Fiddleheads. Hmm. I 
I think they may have been a quest or I'm getting the saves confused. I need to stop playing the other one because it is getting confusing. Yeah, I think I'm thinking of the other save. Oh, well, we're going to bed. It's a little early, but it's fine. I will fill these up though. Um, I will use tomatoes. Sure. Mainly because I'm curious if it will come up here as a fruit or a vegetable. Nope. It should be a fruit. I'm curious if it will be this color, if it will be like tomato jam, or will it be the whatever they call the... <sighs> Hello, family. Magical grass floor, huh? Thanks, son. I don't even know if I have anything to give you. You normally like this. Uh, kids say the silliest things, but it's important that you don't ignore them. I'm glad you're here, dear. That's all. Aww. Okay. Um, I'm curious what the psychedelic floor looks like. I also don't want it to be hideous and then be stuck with it. <laughs> it's kind of where I'm at right now, but I really, really want to know what it looks like. So we might try it out. Oh, that's the Christmas hat. That's right. I forgot about the Christmas hat. I really thought I, it may have been a quest. I might be thinking of a quest that we've got rid of. Um, okay, we're gonna, we're gonna save the game. If I don't like it, we, we will remove it. I don't like it. I'll be back. <gasps> Magically, it's fixed. Oh my goodness. Look at that. It's just magical. Uh, would you like psychedelic flooring, my husband? Thank you. <laughs> it's cool, but at the same time, it's not. <laughs> it's one of those things where it's cool, but... Not permanent. Ooh, thank you for the medicine. And thank you for the pink dye. Good to know. Uh, I don't know where to put this. Um, here's as good as any. Though I do have, what's this? Black wallpaper and aqua. <laughs> I'm going to sell these two also. I'm never going to have black walls. Like, no. Just no. No. I'm going to leave this out here because it doesn't have a home. I'm going to put this out here. Uh, yeah. Okay. We still need to go fishing. I'm like, okay, I'm procrastinating on the fishing because we've done so much fishing in this save. Trade, how would you like this and this? Thank you, dear. You're the best. Um... Red can go here. I don't have um, one of those chests yet, do I know? Oh, <sighs> yeah. The other save, I have an entire chest of melt. Um, I forgot to plant stuff. Oh well. I have an entire chest full of um, the remedies. Ah. Uh. Wow. Well, I guess, no, I guess I was better than I thought I was. I thought I really forgot to plant a lot of stuff. I may have. It looks empty. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Hi. I might plant more tomatoes. Uh, 
Um, yeah, we might plant more tomatoes. Uh, I think, no, because those are renewable. Those are probably from a quest, maybe. I don't know. Did you actually plant? Yes, okay. Part of me is tempted to go kind of all in on the cucumbers and just plant the cucumbers over there. I might, I don't care. I'll just do these two as cucumbers. Look at how adorable this cat is. Just so cute. And uh, I, I went on, on the other side, I just built a coop and I meant to build a fence around the coop. And then I forgot. And I was like, eh, and you know what? We'll leave it. That is probably the cutest cuteness overload. Just watching the animals walk around the farm. It is so cute. I don't, I, part of it, it's nice as it is to see, I mean, you do go in every night. It's not like they're just going to keep roaming and roaming. You do go in every night. I'm almost tempted to not build a fence and just let them roam because it's just so cute watching these little chicks going like dee 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 all over the place. It is just so adorable. Okay. Everything is watered. Probably should check on the baby before I go. You can go in there and you can go in there. They have the cucumbers. You just get so much. <laughs> Just so much seeds after a while. It's just like, wow. This poor little baby, Selena. I did notice that here you can see how her hunger is and all that for babies. you can go in there you can go in there do I have hops in here I do not have hops in here do I have hops in here I do not have hops in there but hops can go in there and in there and this can go outside lovely I need to eat food um I still have to put the watermelons away that's fine light fish okay so That's unfortunate. I won't be able to do this. I was hoping would be ready soon. We still have six days. We can go catch fish. Um, we'll see. I'm going to go put those back on me just in case a miracle should happen and we get more. Uh, where did I put them? I don't remember. I'm going to leave these there just to free up a spot. We will give these to people. I'll just stick these in there just to free up a spot. Um, I'm going to put this in here for now. I'm not going to eat it. <gasps> uh, fiddlehead fern. Did I put it out? Or not the fiddlehead. The, the other one. I think I put it outside. It's outside. If we see people like the witch, we will give her those. And I do need to eat. Thank you. There it is. Okay. We will leave that on us in case we come across a bunch. Um, do I want to go to where is the Francis Hall? Oh, he's way over there. Okay. It's not really like way over there, but it's over there. Ah, uh, my son gets, can get along with just about anyone, even the adults. I wonder how the other colonies are doing. 
Maybe we can learn something from them. Thank you for the recipe and the tar pine sap stuff. Pine sap. This is Jessup's, right? Yeah. Not need anything from him. What do you have, good sir? Hope you are well. My daughter has never been a has never had a problem with sharing toys with the other kids, if I do say so myself. Agnes Bailing knits her own socks sometimes. Isn't that interesting? You have a blueberry. Not helpful. What do you have? Uh, wouldn't it be neat to grow coffee in your yard? You can do it in the summer. Hmm, I'm trying to think of an idea for my next story. Wow, you guys are just so not helpful. It is like almost, it's so amazing. A coal, we need more coal. Or charcoal. You know, like yesterday, I was outside the majority of the day. It was very hot by me. It was like 80, 85 degrees, which is very hot. Like, that's too hot for me. I'm a 60 degrees and lower. Oh, she's having a baby. Oh, it's so cute. Um, I was outside. I will take that just in case I can't get the other one. I can. I'm not doing maple syrup. You can get your own gosh darn maple syrup. Uh, what do you have on you? I've heard so many stories about faraway lands. I don't even want know what to believe. My daughter just loves cherry pie. You have maple syrup today. Oh, I wish I could transport that into the other safe. Dang. That sucks. Oh. Is that? She's pregnant with our new... Um, yeah, that would be my new niece or nephew. Yeah. Yeah, I was, I didn't realize after doing, until I did the family tree, how related I, the, I am now to the town. <laughs> uh, Honeywood is so darn crowded during those day, the day. Not really. Some pieces of meat come tender when you cook them. For a long time, but not all of them. Uh, view quest. I might have that. And I needed nothing that you have. I'm going to go see if I have tallow. And if not, um, we'll just buy it from her. I thought I had some, though. I can get rid of this stuff. I don't need this stuff. The sap. That is really good. That is probably more sap than we will need in this entire playthrough. Um, This can go there. Medicinal properties. A. Yeah, those ones, I, I never know where the correct place to put them is. Is it in the house? Hi. I don't know what you're doing today. Tallow, aha. Um, I'm just gonna, I'm, I guess I'll put that there. I'm not, I'm not seeing any more, okay. We'll go back to town nice when you can kind of just <laughs> go do that really quick they, they definitely increased this so much i was struggle bussing for a while on that one there we go okay so that is done. I would like to do fishing, but if I don't get to it, it is not the end of the world. So we need to go to the forest. We need another goat ribby thing. 
We're going to go to Roland and get, hopefully, you know, digging up ore is more fun than it looks. I'm usually not the most talkative person, but with Martha, I feel like I can say anything. Ten. Yeah, we definitely need to um, get charcoal kiln going soon it doesn't get used for a lot i will i don't i don't think so uh she, yeah she shouldn't be too, too mm, do i take the i'll go here uh, whoops that's a wrong button we'll just go to here and hopefully we'll head her off Hello! My spouse is just the sweetest person when it come, when we're alone together. Market day is always held in town square on Sundays. Nice. Um, so that cleared up that one. Working on that. I'm going to go to the forest now. And fishing. What fish is that? I don't remember. I don't think we're going to catch nine. Oh, that's by our house, isn't it? Yeah, we may. Well, we'll tonight and tonight fishing on our farm. That I think is going to be the game plan. But anyways, I don't know if I've finished my, my outside story. I did planted all of my flower pots and all of my flower beds. It's always a very nice feeling to do that. Hindsight with how miserable I feel today. I maybe should not have done it. <laughs> uh, okay, who wanted these? You did, okay. Yeah, hindsight being 2020, I probably shouldn't have done it. It need to get done. I mean, it's like one of those things. Like, there's only X amount of time to kind of do that stuff. And so it's like, because like for me, it's like the um, cottonwood season is, which is like their, the poplar trees. And um, so everywhere is just like dust. It's just like these dust and these fuzzies. It's like everywhere is these white fuzzies floating. It looks like it's snowing white fuzzies. And it's just so annoying. And you were just getting like them stuck in your nose and your eyelashes. Just like, just go away, trees. Let me be. But yeah, it was just so bad. Hello, son. You are still at home. You. I can't perchance mail it to you, can I? Okay, um, we're going to go home and go fishing, I think. I don't even feel like going to that part because I had nothing to turn in. No, I don't. Sorry for that. Um, we're going to go fishing for the rest of the night. I need a... Common lure. have it on yes I do we still need to get two more lures I don't remember yeah we need the uh, crustacean one I think I really think that's the one I need is crustacean it's the one that looks like a like a little pot which is an awful explanation of what it is but it's, you know it has like a it's like a container. And it's like brown. There's one. Mackerel. It's a gold one, though. We can donate it. Thanks, seaweed. I 
wish they would just get rid of the seaweed drops. Well, no, I wish they would get rid of the old shoe drops or allow us to compost them or something. Because having them have no use is just... And I have a feeling the seaweed problem or the algae probably can get used in something. I have no idea if it does. I haven't seen anything. But like the shoes and the seaweed and the algae. The seaweed, I think, is a cooking thing. There's two. And if we don't get this, it's not end of the world. It is just like. We're just we're we're leveling up fishing like that's what we're doing. It's fine. <clears throat> Three. Yeah, I think in this part of the game, the fishing quests that you do get, because before it was bought, get three of the fish. I think nine is pretty steep. I I think it should be lowered to, I think it, the max number should be about six, five or six. I think nine is pretty steep. And because we started fishing at like four o'clock. Like, so that's four hours of fishing already. So, I mean, we've got what, three of them. So you're going to be fishing for over 12 hours to get this based upon RNG. So, yeah, that to me needs to be lowered. Mackerel. Yeah, today after I'm done filming this. As much as I don't want to bug hunt for the game, I do think uh, I'm filming this on the 21st. So I'm going to go finally, I think, check out the quote unquote beta for Coral Island. I'm going to check it out. I might bug hunt. I'm probably I'm. I'm probably not going to submit a single bug, just saying, because they don't fix bugs in that game. They just pretend they don't exist. So, but I'm, I might. I'm thinking about it. It's mainly, I just want to see the material. That's all I want to do. I want to romance Semaru and I want to try the ocean farming. We'll see. It might be already too late for them. Oh, well. I think we're just going to go to bed after this fish. Frog. I will say it is very difficult to decide where you want to put your coupon barn. I don't know where I want to put them. I have no idea on this farm. I wish we had. I'm only thinking this because I just said talk about Coral Island. I wish we had. How is if I go in the door? Um, I wish we had the same uh, feature like Coral Island has that gives you the overview of the farm. I'm really missing that mode for this game. Like it doesn't have to be anything truly spectacular or special, but it, it's, it's so difficult to try to plan where you want your coupon barn. Because the barn is so much bigger than I thought it was going to be. I started building it and then just, I like, no. That it's, it's so big. Just so big. Hello, son. Hi, mom. Um, why do grown-ups hate raccoons? I think they're cute. Well, as a grown-up, I think they're adorable and just misunderstood. Potatoes are the best when they're fried. Thank you. Wow, that is like, <laughs> that is psychedelic. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that would give me a headache. Ah, uh, you go there. I don't think you're in there. You're not in there, I know. Ah, uh, you can go in here. Um, 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 that's for a quest. This was a gifty. That's fine. Okay. Pardonnez-moi. Wedding? 
I will take a picture of that to add it to my spreadsheet. No, it's not a spreadsheet, my picture. Um, you want cabbage stew. Sure. And you're giving me medicine. Thank you. What is required for cabbage stew? Potatoes, cabbage, and peas. Ooh. Cabbage. Right? How many does he want? Four. What? What am I missing? Oh, a potato. Can I add? No. You suck, game. Okay, well, we're going to sit here for 20 seconds and go outside. Oh, she grew up! Look at her! Hi. Yes. There's always something new to do in life. Isn't that fun? Sometimes I see raccoons in the farm at night. What are they looking for? She's so cute. I think we're going to try to get her an apprenticeship with uh, Jessup Edwards. I don't... I don't know the death cake in this, do I? No. One more. Hard. Mm, do I want to be up to no good? No, we're not going to. We're not going to murder people in this. There's no one aliving. No. Ooh, these are full grown. Nice. You can give people the death cake and there's, I believe, a chance that they will pass away. It just how much do I actually want her to be a blacksmith? I don't know, not that much. I'm a little worried that the thought actually crossed my mind. Hey, it's a mechanic in the game. You know? Death is an everyday occurrence. <laughs> uh. Part of me wants, I, I, part of me really wants to, just to learn the death recipe, just to see what it does. I have no idea. I, I know that you, it exists and you can give people a death cake as a gift and there's a chance that they can die. But I don't know if I want to know that much. <laughs> that I'm actually willing to unalive somebody. I don't know. Now we'll we'll see if we can give her uh, into Jessup Edwards, into his uh, apprenticeship. I don't know what skill they learn. It was just mainly it was nice being given free medicine, and it was nice having access to his inventory, his store, um, to kind of check every day what was in stock. That was kind of it. Like it wasn't. That was about why it was useful, was for those reasons. Um, I need this. One, two, three, and I have a very full inventory. Yes, I do. Oh my goodness. Nope, I do not need the seeds for this. You could try to put them in there all day and they ain't gonna do much. Uh, shoes, this. And I thought I put you in here. Yes, I did. Um, 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 that can be don't well, this can be donated. There, thank you. Uh that can get donated. This can get donated. I have that. I need to get one more. This can go in there, and I think these can go in there. How did you not go in the top anymore? Shoes, you get out of here. At this point, I want to know how many shoes am I gonna get in it in one save. I will eat a plum tart. 
Ooh, too bad I wasn't sick. There's that. There we go. That's done. Ah, uh, it was the next one. Mm. Oh, okay. that's so annoying. Okay. Um. Okay. So. Is he actually there or is he away? Oh, okay. I can actually get to him. Okay. Yeah, we're not going to be able to finish this one. That's, that's a shame. Okay, we're going to go to Francis Hall first. Tis the game plan. Um, we'll check the kids for anything fun. I mean, that kind of works towards things, but not really. So never mind. I think that was it. Didn't I have a peach quest? I kind of think the peach quest is just going to have to go bye bye. And I don't think there is a penalty for not completing a quest. Um, at least in the tutorial, it says there's not. So. I will stick with what the tutorial says that I cannot be penalized for failing that. Oh, hi. Oh. Want to show my appreciation. Thank you. All it takes is a little kindness to brighten someone's day. Bridget Lloyd always told me that reading a book, good book shouldn't feel like studying. That's true, right? I don't know. Read a book. Hello. Reading is fun, isn't it? You can learn so much from reading a book or two. Wow, we're only talking about books today. Nothing makes me happier than sharing pot roast with the family. Thank you much. Ooh. The question is, hi, morning. I don't get along to, with too many people, but I must admit you're one of the few that are good ones. Oh, thank you. Uh, why does the king keep raising our taxes? Does he think we're made of money? Yes. Um, I actually don't think being he has the inventory for the doctor, I don't know. I don't think the apprenticeship for the doctor will be open. We'll find out. Not then I'll have to think in between episodes what I want her to do. Little Selena. Okay, so how many of those do I have now? Eight. I'm going to go with him first. Uh, just because it does have a recipe. And we will hope that we find more. That, I think, is the game plan as of right now. Uh, I also will go to the ghosties and go give them, give the altar some stuff. Today is Thursday. When is the holiday here? What oh, want this? Ooh, we'll be next episode. It's a call. It's the bake off. Um, it's like, uh, hmm. 
If they're, they should be coming in any day now. So I'm going to hope that they do. Oh, we need to get one more thing here. Or check for one thing here. Um, It's like a... Uh, do you think mermaids exist? I think it's possible. There's so much that we don't know. It takes more than a passion for food to become a birch butcher. You also have to get your hands dirty. Literally. Well, I hope you wash them too. Literally. We'll sell this and then trade those off. That's gold. I will pay a penny. Or no, you're giving me a penny. Thanks. Brother-in-law. If you learn woodworking, you can build anything, anything in the world. I don't say this often, but I feel like I never get tired when I talk to you. Well, I would hope so, being more family. But okay. Um, trying to think what's... Okay, um, the only thing I can think of off the top of my head that it's like is uh, in Portia. My time at Portia. The game. Friends should look out for each other. Let me know if something's wrong, okay? Aw. The crows are always pecking at my crops. And get a scarecrow. Um, in Portia, there is a game during, hmm, I think the, I think it's the Harvest Fest, where you need to cook dishes for people. Greetings. Shad are common fish, as long as you're fishing in salt water. They are very definitely common. People keep talking about the witch who lives in the bog out west. But I couldn't be bothered to walk over there. Okay. Um, in my time in Portia, there's a game in which oh, who's there's an apprentice. Oh, she's just giving me money. Thank you. Nothing is helpful. Okay. Um, where you the town you get like a thing and you're given three ch chances to make different dishes um like you're given like a, a, a list of ingredients a, and you just pick which one you think is correct and you get awarded points based upon if it's correct or not it's kind of like that um but like you have like a a pantry that is all the fruits and veggies. You have a fridge that is all the cold, like the stuff that should be in a fridge. Um, it is like, and but it's not just baking, it's anything, but like you have the three judges and they tell you something to bake or cook and you just find the ingredients and cook it and then give it to them. And then they give you the next one and it just kind of, that's what it is. So I think like Quentin is a judge. I think Kate is a judge or cat. And then um, one of the captains, I think, is normally who come on the ships is normally a judge. I will have my uh, spreadsheet open. And so there'll be a lot of pausing um, to do to get that done. Um, but it's just like you need to bake things as fast as possible. I think you're given like five to seven minutes. Um, I think I've I've won it before. I think I won it with like um I think I made like five recipes and I won it. But you need to make them correctly, like first off. <laughs> um but I think it took like five recipes, but it can literally be anything. So you need at least the wiki open or a spreadsheet of all the recipes that something that you can search really fast and like they are they do give you an icon like a picture but you can also go and click I'm um, looking for I think you um there's a, a they, if you don't know what if, if you forgot you can thank you uh go back to the judge and they'll tell you what it is again I'll try it. You're giving the recipe ones for them. You always want to try. Where are you going? I'm going to reject it because that ain't worth it. Not, well, I can make a butter churn. 
that's an e that's an easier one, so we may just do this one. How's life been treating you? I am gonna say no. Okay, we have stuff to donate, but yeah, but that's what it's like. Um, it's very difficult to try to like you have to memorize a lot of things in order to get it. We need ten more fish. Ooh, we only need to know five more fish. We need still. Ooh, I did not realize that. Okay, we'll, we'll turn in ten more gold here. This I still. Really? Interesting. I did not realize that's what that was. Okay. Well, that makes this close it. Thank you. Um, that makes this easier. I'm not giving you that stuff, though. Um, I may just go clear out my stuff. We may go take another pit stop and go clear out stuff that I've made already. So I did probably just screw my, oh my goodness. I did, yeah, I just screwed myself on this one. It's fine. Uh, okay. I don't remember what I just put on there. Oh, I think it was tomatoes because I want to know where they get categorized. I think that's what it was. So we need to go home. That's very interesting though. Okay. Um, actually, I do want to go in the mines today. So we will go into the mines. Hi. How's it going, my old friend? There are some folk in Honeywood who are less fortunate than other others. It's the, the least we can do to help them. There aren't many musical composers in the new world. Do you think Honeywood will ever have a composer of its own? Have a great rest of your day. She's just like too pure for this world. <laughs> uh, it's like all oh, sunshine and rainbow. How much room do I have? That's the, oh, okay, a lot actually. Oh, it helps if I get this out. So we may load up on more harvestables just to see if we can knock that out next episode. Like the harvestables and the crafted items. I never realized what went under the craftable things. That actually is a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. The 10 placeable, I, I think I'm going to make 10, the 10 fences and see if it works. I, that's what I think we're going to try that next episode. And like I said, if I, I think I've said this before, if it, if you, we cannot donate those, then I'll just use it around my coop. I don't care. But I'll never know unless I try. Yeah, we may just go clear out our, uh, we may actually just go home and do it today. Pick up the rock. Thank you. Yeah, we may just do that today. Um, the only thing that... Wow, this is a big vein. Uh, the only thing that may stop us is the nail. So it, it also depends on if I see Roland. Like starting to feel my voice fading away. Like I can just feel it. <laughs> Probably can hear it because I hear it. What do we get? What do we get? A lot of gold. Okay. Nope, that's the wrong button. Yeah, so we're going to go through our... Uh, 
chest and see what can be given. I guess given away, not just given. What could we be given? I don't know. That makes no sense. Alrighty. Um, I will donate the gold. Just because I'm curious as to how fast it kind of adds up. Um, that's good. Hello, children. Um, that's because I didn't really have any gold stuff left. That's why, because I already kind of cleared it out. That is a little bit of why. Nope, this I wanted. Flowers I will keep on me for gifts. Hello, kitty cat. How was Tinkerball today? Um... Gold. Um... Three nails. Three nails. They're all three nails. Yeah, the only thing that will stop us is uh, the nails, actually. Nine nails, you don't say. I'll do this. Okay, I'm gonna grab whatever's in this chest. If there's anything gold, nothing is gold. Oh, uh, what time is it going to be? That's going to be like, I'm just going to end the episode and we will just do this next time. Um, I mean, I really am curious. I really want to know. <laughs> we'll just wait till next episode. That way some of this stuff will get done too. We just need to donate a few more gold items done then. And it's really, those will be under the uh, forgeables. Ah, this was fish. That's right. All right. So then we already did the tomato. I'm so not with it. <laughs> uh, it's like I. It's like today was one of those days where it's like, should I film? I don't know. And I'm like, fine, I'll do it. And it's like I probably just shouldn't. I should have just went to bed, or just went and continued laying down. That's what I was doing. I was laying down. I had a headache. Anyways, um, she needs to eat food. Um, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode that goes with the Plum Grove. Next episode, we're going to donate all this stuff. We're going to test the fences. See if those work under the 10 placeable. I don't see why they wouldn't. Um, yeah, because that's definitely a lot easier than I thought it was. I think the whole, the, I think the hardest pillar is going to be the cooking. Because it wants so many gold. We may have to start buying gold level recipes and giving them to people. We may have to start doing that. I don't know how else to do that. Um, but anyway, so I hope you enjoyed. Take care of yourself and bye for now.